press 4 to learn more about the martial art of dad jokes with a token DILF trouble base. Half year already, time flies. Press 4 to learn more about the martial art of dad jokes with a token DILF trouble base. Yo a cutie. Hello. <gasps> yeah, six months already. Thank you, Bart. Thank you, Manu. Yeah, I just went to go and grab something. Quite back. So we shall go to the big camera so we can see what's in this package, shall we? Is Manu there? Because I know she'll want to see. I made sure to take Bart's details off so I don't accidentally dox him while I'm opening the box. So we'll see what's in it, shall we? Yeah, I managed to dox you both a few times already. Sherry, you can go ahead. So yeah, uh, Manu did a little drawing of an origami crane as well. I'm assuming Manu drew that. Oh, it's cute. <laughs> so we have this. What this is. Oh, you haven't. Oh, you haven't. You shouldn't have got me this. Yeah, I'll be playing that soon. Oh, you really shouldn't. I'm sure it'll be hentai enough Manu, like Princess Peach is in it, she gets around a bit. Oh. Let's see what else we've got, shall we? We have Poppy Tweets. These are awesome. These will not take long to go. We have Cheap TTS seven trillion seven hundred and seventy seven billion seven hundred and seventy seven million seven hundred and seventy seven thousand seven hundred and seventy seven. I might save some to Kelly if she's nice for me. So I know Kelly likes stroop waffles as well. Then we have I don't know what these are. I have no idea what they are. <gasps> cinnamon. Oh, they like cinnamon sticks. Mmm. That'd be cool. Damn. <gasps> Chocolate speculata. I know I'll like these. Because I like speculars already. So I'm definitely going to like these. Mm. 
Eggs. They have eggs. Nom 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 nom. A bag of bites. Yeah, these are birthday birthday stuff. I have mysterious jar. Be anything. Bomb. Have. Oh. Yeah. Love to spread. I'm not. I know what I'm having for my breakfast tomorrow. I'm gonna try that out tomorrow, definitely. We have greetings from Holland. <laughs> Made it. <laughs> Made in Denmark. Oh yeah, Jacobson's Bakery, Bakery Limited in Denmark. Doubt you'll be able to see that. <laughs> Tag tea biscuits. So it lists all the large towns and cities as well. Just got Eindhoven and Maastricht and Rotterdam on it. Mm. Thank you, Manu. Thank you, Bart. I'll be scoffing some of those later. Definitely. <laughs> so, like I said, I might save some street waffles for Kelly. It depends how nice she is to me. I might just end up eating them. So, should we get back to penguins? Because I've started making my base, so we're about ready to kidnap one of these little penguins, aren't we? Penguins! So, oh, I know what I should do. I should save some of those biscuits for Friday, because on Friday I am going to see Beth. We're going to meet up in town with another one of our friends we've not seen for ages. <gasps> Beth! Hello! Yeah, you can actually steal a penguin in this game. So I'm going to steal a penguin. That's what I was going to do as well, because Alex was on about doing a trouble jam emote as well. So we'll go back to Big Cam for a second, and I'll just jam along to the, the subnautical music. Game's still loading anyway. There we go, that should give you enough footage to grab on. Right. What was we doing? Oh, yeah. Vehicle platform, weren't we? Because. I want to build my submarine, so I need gold. Had I found out where to get gold yet? Possibly not. Got an exterior grow bed. Indoor plants. Desks. Beds. Office toys and stuff. And they must be parts of the alien, so 
Got beacons. Um, research. Geological. Gold and titanium is calaverite. So that's the thing we need to look for. Now, do we have any water or anything stashed? Does not look like it. Unless that is snow. I wonder if I can turn the snow into water bottles or something. Just on the off chance. Um, I need to go back to the little rescue hut. Or the escape pod. Fabricator, uh, it does not look like it. Water. Yeah, we can get filtered water from a bladder fish and that's it. Um, so we'll keep an eye out for some bladder fish. In the meantime, we need to go get some gold, which would be this way, somewhere. There's our sea monkey friend. Hello. <sighs> we will eat the fish when we find some tasty ones. Like, there's ones with massive eyes which are like easily the best ones to make food out of. I just need to find some. These guys. This little peeper, it's called. I think he's called. They're like the best ones to make food out of. Hi, Emily. Uh, I need my sea glide. There. No. And sea glide needs a battery, which we are running low on. Tell you what, we'll take it out of the, the builder. Swap it in. Bladder fish. Come here. So the plan is I need to find some gold. Oh, yeah, I can eat these as well, can I? No. So I need to build the... Is it raining again? Yeah, it is. I need to build a computer chip, which I need copper and table coral and gold for. And once I have the computer chip, I can make the... Thing that makes our submarines like the fabricator or the mobile vehicle bay or whatever it's called so which direction was all the coral and stuff in was it this way so we need to find the bit where it goes deep down we can have a look at the storm up top shall we ah it's just raining Uh, 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 uh. I love that you can hear the thunder and stuff while you're underwater. So we are looking for... What was that mineral called? Calaverite or Calverite. How are you supposed to say it? Limestone, Galena. Hmm. A scanner thingy. Grav trap. Hello. Thank you for the quartz. So, which direction was it? <laughs> 
I'm sure I've just got lost and I'm going completely the wrong way again. So this way we've got more of the seaweed. And then we've got this kind of spiky looking bit. Oh yeah, this is where the um, volcanic vents Warning. were. 30 seconds of oxygen remaining. Gold! Perfect. So we'll head back up. Now we need to find copper. We'll be back this way somewhere. Which one is the copper in? Silver, gold, lead, and titanium. Titanium, it's copper. So I just need limestone. Another bladder fish. Copper. Need one more. Copper. And I need some table coral. Now where did I find table coral last time? Oh, right here. Need my knife. We'll grab a few chunks of table coral because I'm not sure how many I'll need. Where can we see more? These guys are cool. I thought they were gonna get me at first. Yeah, it's a knife might. Get some more oxygen off this fancy plant. Where is more table coral? Oh, friend! Oh, new friend! Hey! Oh, friend! Please be my friend! Oh, hey. friend! Thank you for the follow, Amley. There we go. We have more table coral now. This is what we need. We're going to have to go down there at some point. I am not looking forward to it. It is scannable here, is it this thing? Crescent moon coral. See, I keep hearing that sound. And I don't know what's making it. It makes me nervous. Because it sounds like a whale. It's definitely that direction. Uh. See, there it is again. Whatever it is, it's big. I just can't find it. Not that I particularly want to, in case it's something mean, but... build our mobile vehicle bear and then see what we need to make our first submarine. Grab another bladder fish as well for some more water. You. I have determined the location of some important technology. I implore you to investigate. Will we this will help us do. build you a body? I do not know what we will find. I just know it is important. Okay, Alan, we will go and have a look soon. uploaded to PDA. Once I have an actual submarine, we will go and explore. Build you a new body, Alan, but you've got to be patient. Right. Get that. 
Now, we need to make some copper wire. That allows us to make a computer chip. So I can unpin that recipe and now I can make mobile vehicle bay. And then we can start making our submarine. Go. Release the vehicle bay. Um, let's go that direction. Final board. Right. What do we need to build the sea truck? We need a titanium ingot, advanced wiring, two glass, three lead, and a power cell. Um, can it, will it let me pin that? It will. Oh no, it's hailstone in again. Right, let's check our supplies. I also need you guys to come up with a... Well, I'm not sure if we'll be able to name it straight away, but we will see. So... Oh... And the table coral and the snowball. Right, so. We've got a battery. Um, I wonder, does the other thing have a battery charger? Or am I going to have to build one before I run out of batteries and stuff? You do not have a battery charger. Right. Percival. Right, Beth, you got in first. We will. Once we can name it, we will call it Percival. So, first up, we need a titanium ingot. Which will just be 10 titanium. Or 5, however much it is. And we'll need. Some glass. So, uh, do we have any quartz? We've got one quartz. Let's have a look. So, ingot is five, yeah. Uh, regular glass takes two quartz, so I need three more quartz. Uh, I got any lead. I've got two lead, so I'll need one more. Uh, advanced wiring kit. What do we need for that? So that's how we make batteries. So we make a power cell. We need to make another computer chip to make the advanced wiring kit. So we'll do... So let's make some batteries first, shall we? Uh, ribbon plants and copper ore. <laughs> One copper ore. Are you fully grown yet? You're not, are you? Right, we'll find some ribbon plants nearby. Uh, how many are in the plant? Or just the one? So... What are you bringing me? Lead! Just what I needed. Right, um... One, two, three, four, five, six... Right, so we'll grow some more ribbon plants there and... Go out and find some, and some quartz. Percy!
You'll all see. Um. Yeah, more filtered water. There we go, we are topped up on water, we got some food. Should check what we actually need to make a battery charger really. If I even have the recipe. Um swap you out. Swap you in. Battery charger, wiring kit, copper wire, titanium. A regular wiring kit is I think that's just silver, isn't it? Uh, yeah, two silver. So we really need a battery charger. So two copper, two silver, one titanium or what I need. There they are, all growing nicely for me. Welcome aboard, Captain. Uh, one titanium. Don't have any silver or copper here. Let's go searching. Get a present. Ribbon plant. That'll do. There's a ribbon plant. There's a ribbon plant. They will do handy for making more batteries. More titanium. Yeah, I've worked out that the the slightly squealing sounds are the um, the sea monkeys. It's like the deeper well well kind of sound that I've. That sound. Don't know what that sound is yet. Right. Uh, battery charger, we could copper wire. We need silver now. Which one is the silver? Uh, titanium, copper, golden titanium, silver. So I need argentite. Grab a couple more of these. Are there any handy penguins nearby I could steal? Ah, this way. So I'm going to steal a penguin for the base while we're at it. Hello little friend, you're coming with me. Quick run, run before the parent spots me. Kidnap the penguin. Let me in. There we go. We have successfully kidnapped a penguin. Oh, look at him. So, 
How do we let him wander around? Can I drop him? Um. I don't know if I can drop him to uh, let him wander around or not. Unless I need some sort of place for him to live. <laughs> oh, it sneezed. Right, we shall keep you with us for now. Until I work out what we can put you in. Um, yeah, that sounds like absolute chaos, Emily. Like, I've seen a couple of mods for the first one where... Um, they've added in extra stuff, like... Um, fish and other leviathans that were from... Like from the alpha or from concept art and stuff and people have modded them in but some of them are terrifying first of all we make copper wire now we have enough spare for at least one battery <laughs> Percy the penguin not need the repair tool much so we'll take the battery out of that um, right let's take the batteries out of everything actually sort them out that way So, unload all the batteries. Um, put the flashlight in there, because I've not really needed the flashlight much. And we'll put the other ribbon plants in there as well. So we will be using... We got the mineral scanner, we got you sign knife. Uh, you do not need much battery. We'll put the empty batteries in the container as well. Um, you will be using a bit. You'll be using a bit. And you'll be using a bit as well. Um, We need a wiring kit now, so we need two silver to make a battery charger. Beep, 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 beep. I've just got to remember which direction I've actually got to go in to find stuff. I think it's this way. So, silver is in... Argentite. But you, you still do need some more of these bits. But just a wandering piece of titanium. Tell you what, what am I doing? I've got. 
thing specifically for this. Lithium, double coral, calavera, salt, argentite. There. I'm not going to eat Percy. Percy's our pet. I'm strong, you'll be. And it gives me titanium. Warning. Typical. 30 seconds of oxygen remaining. Yep. Get to the surface. We'll get to an oxygen plant. Are there any? Can't see any nearby, so. Break for the surface it is. Yeah, Percy is not getting eaten. Oxygen. But everything else I will happily eat. But Percy can stay where he is. There it is. More tight. Come on, give me some silver. I need silver. No, I'm not going to eat him. I'll tell Manu you were suggesting we eat birds, and she'll share it again. Silver. Got it. She will. She'll share it to you. <laughs> What's this? Mobile. Oh, I've already got a mobile vehicle bay, but scan it for the free titanium. Warning. 30 seconds of oxygen remaining. I am aware. Bew, 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 bew. So now I've gone the wrong way. I need to go to my base, don't I, and build it there. Welcome aboard, Captain. So we need a battery charger. First, we need a wiring kit. So I was going the right way. Wiring kit. <laughs> Hi, Neo. How it goes? How are you feeling? Sea monkey, sea monkey, do you have a gift? See, you've got something in your hands. Give it me. Give it me. Sea monkey. Thank you. Now I can build battery charger. Right, so we 
you in there, put you in there. So what do we need? We still need a power cell, which is two batteries and some rubber. shall we? So, make more batteries. There. Um, we need some glass, which we've got enough for. There's two glass. Now it's just the advanced wiring kit and the power cell we've got to make. Oh yeah, charger. Wait a second, we needed the lead, didn't we? Lead. Uh, glass. So. Power cell. We need some of the rubber stuff, which I don't have at the moment. Boom, 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 boom. Hi Maeve! How's things? Um, so everybody's turning up today. So we've got pilot signal and the architect artifact to find. Where are you? I just heard you. There you are. You brought me more copper ore. Good boy. Right, what do I need to make power cell? Power cell we need. There. Power cell is two batteries and silicone rubber. Silicone rubber, we need seeds. Handily, I'm growing some right here. And I have batteries. So we'll take two mostly full batteries. Use them to make a power cell. Yeah, sounds like a good job for it, Maeve. Right, we've been cutting the grass and everything lately. And yeah, it is very warm. Right, there is power cell. So I can take that recipe off. So I don't need you. I still need to make an advanced wiring kit and a computer chip. So if I need more copper, table coral and gold. I'm sure I've got some of.
Um, got a single piece of table coral. So I need table coral, gold, copper, and silver. And I need to find some bladder fish or something as well. New creature discovered. Boomerang, you're getting in. Eat. Um wonder how I make bleach in this one because in the previous one you could make bleach from tube coral <laughs> can you not? have you got BTTV installed or anything? Like mine's been a bit weird lately Yeah, it's thin sheet or no sheet at the moment, otherwise I just roast to death. I am a warm person anyway, like, literally at winter I, I get used as a heat battery. So when it gets warmer in the summer, I just sort of roast. bleach recipe on here anywhere. Silicone, no. Synthetic fibres and aerogel. No. Copper wire, no. So no indication of how to make bleach or bigger water supplies yet. Let's go looking for more copper and stuff. Turns copper. Perfect. Piece of copper. That's two. So that will give us the copper wire. I need gold and another piece of table coral and I need two pieces of silver. Copper. Copper. This bit I've seen, yeah, I've seen this bit before. Grab this fish. New creature discovered. Whoop fish. Limestone, limestone, limestone. Not what I need. All good, Maeve. I got a. A parcel from Manu and Bart today filled with goodies. So I'll be scoffing some of them later. Although I do need to save some for Beth when I go and, when I go and see Beth. Uh, a parcel. It's like presents. They even got me a game as well. Which was really nice. They really shouldn't have. Table coral, that's what I needed. Right, so we got two pieces of table coral. I still need gold, still need silver. Um, Argentite was a chance of silver. Galena was a chance of lead. Does that sound again? Warning. 30 seconds of oxygen remaining. Right, let's head up. Uh, 
They've known where I've been living for a while. Although I can just Oxygen. like handily look into the back garden here. Just in case Manu is uh, hiding out there somewhere. Oh, hi Kelly! It's a shark. <laughs> Just shit Bart over. I would not mind that. We shall keep Bart in Kelly's old room. Gold and silver, please. Where are all the oxygen plants hiding? There used to be lords around here. Do that or I'm just blind. Um, lead, copper. There's one. <laughs> oh yeah, Brina gets a bit jealous when other people what when people watch other people's streams. Yeah, Sherry dropped by to say hello earlier. There's some here in this direction. Is it down? But it is, isn't it? Silver, no, gives me titanium, doesn't it? Some lead. See, I can hear that sound even more, and I don't like it. Although apparently there's an alien place nearby, so just head in that direction, shall we? Diamond. More diamond. Yeah, Sherry's got his scam descriptions on again. Please be silver. I got one piece of silver out of the two that I need. And I still need some gold as well. Ah, another oxygen plant. Titanium rubbish. I do love that view. Although I found out this is coral, it's not tentacles. It is literally just a kind of coral. I well thought it was tentacles. Where are you at? Some more of this stuff here somewhere. Oh, I went past it. Give me silver! Gotcha. Now I need gold. Which one is gold? This one. Weeb. 
It's a weep shark. <laughs> a weep shark. All I need now is one piece of gold. Ooh woo sharky ooh woo. Ooh woo gweggy ooh woo. <laughs> I still don't like that sound purely because I don't know what it is. So it makes me want to avoid it. That sound is fine, that's those little Cool, buggers. there's working TTS here. Yeah, Amelie, I have two kinds of TTS just in case one of them breaks. Hey, buddy. Sea Monkey is my friend. Not the little assholes that they were when we first came across them. Look. Oh, <gasps> Oh, sea Monkey brought me gold! It was at this moment that he knew. He fucked up. Right, Sea Monkey is officially awesome. He brought me gold. Gold was just what I needed. Penguin! Penguin! <laughs> Ah, oh, bring a plane, Last of Us. <gasps> I do like Last of Us. It is quite a good game. I've not played the second one yet, and I really need to. It is in my long list of games that I still need to play at some point. Although, all my holidays from work have literally reset today. I am tempted to book some time off. Just to chill and play games for a bit. What's this? Oh, it's Nick. Holiday Aaron, yes. Right, I've got tomorrow and Thursday off this week, but they're technically just rest days off because I worked at the weekend. So, yeah, I'm tempted to book a solid week off. I go, fuck it, I'm going to spend the entire time playing games. Right. Give me you. First. War. Oh, is gameplay good for Last of Us 2? Good. Because I quite liked, like, uh, games like that I do like stealthing around in. So like sneaking up on things in the first one, I quite liked. Like when you could get close to the clickers to take them out. That's with a copper wire. That allows us to make the computer chip. The computer chip now. And silver allows us to make the wiring kit. This allows us to make an advanced wiring kit out of both. And that gives us all the stuff we need to make our first submarine. Let's go. You make a submarine sight sea truck. <gasps> Wait a second. That looks modular. Oh, it is. It's like an actual truck, like a lorry. Sweet. We. So it's only got a depth of 150 meters at the moment, but it is still 150. I can dip down and then 
swim the rest of the way if I need to. I need to find the stuff that lets me customise it first, Manu, unfortunately. So what we could do with now, we'll go and see... Thermos, do we need to make a thermos? Titanium and glass. Insulated storage receptacle for be beverages. Right. So, unpin all. Do I have any water on me at the moment? No. So we'll dump these materials in storage. Welcome aboard, Captain. <laughs> Shots and drinks for the losers. That sounds deadly. I need some water. So, we're just going to have to find... Some bladder fish. Is there any knocking around? Sea monkey! <laughs> You're just going to get worse as you go. See, we did one once on Counter Strike years ago when I was at uni, based off uh, a video we'd seen. And we were doing shots of vodka, and it was cheap vodka as well. Like, not nice vodka. And the way we did it was, every time you died, you had to do a shot. But, if you managed to knife kill somebody, everybody else had to do a shot. And that was dangerous. I think we lasted two matches. And then we were all flopping all over the place. <laughs> yeah, it was bit like we'd seen somebody do it on a YouTube video and we thought, look it, we'll give it a try. And we are much worse at the game than the people are in the YouTube video, so we did not last very long. Got some water. Got some food. Now we can do proper exploring because we've got our submarine. We can go much further and much faster. So first of all, get in. We're gonna go look. Oh, this thing is miles faster. We're going to go and have a look for that ancient artifact over this way. <laughs> I know somebody who spent a few, like, hours playing Spore after they'd taken acid and they were completely freaked out by it. Right, this we need to explore because this is resources and I've not been here yet. What was that sound? It's another storm. Get out and see what we've got. PDA. Ah, jeez. These sea monkeys are gonna get me in trouble. This is the third shipment that those buggers have gotten their weird little hands into. Now we're <laughs> running low on flares, and I'm gonna have to search nearby nests for stolen cargo. They're lucky they're kind of cute. Raccoons of the sea, those ones. What's this thing? Looks like hologram or something. Weird. Right, what's down here? Oh, there are lights! They're pointing the way. That's cool. So that says go that way. Anyway, 
see what these are. They're just some stuff. That was a recipe I've already got. Food. Flare. Nothing massively useful. Like some water and some food. But that's about it. Oh, these are brinacles. Right, so I'll see this thing. This is super cold water. Like, this stuff is super cold compressed water. It is actually usually about 10 20 degrees below zero and can quite yeah you see it growing down there that's what they do usually not that fast but they grow downwards and when they touch the floor they start feeding freezing everything around it and it's literally just a death sentence for anything within range oxygen yeah no i need oxygen i'm just gonna get in my little truck We've actually got little arrows here pointing us towards something. Oi! So this arrow points this direction. <laughs> Gotta be anything cool over here. Nah, uh, lots of pants and stuff. Right, I still need to find my way to this ancient artifact. So there'll probably be a way down over here somewhere. I'm hoping. Sea monkeys. More brinacles. This is just sort of an empty bit, isn't it? Blocked off. So I need to look for caves or something. way down no but there is a sea monkey nest is there anything useful I can scan from it uh no oops oops don't want to keep crashing into stuff. Right, we got oxygen plant. What looks to be a tunnel network. Ooh. Ooh, is this blood caliber? Hello, friend. Root pustule. Grab a couple of these and see what they do. I still need to find my way down to that artifact. off everything. Still 33 meters straight down. 
but <gasps> this sea monkey egg. I know, it's your baby. Steal the part. Oh, it brought me some quartz. Steal it. See, look. It's doubly appropriate, Alex, because when I first saw the sea monkeys, they were stealing things as well. So, they're perfect. Right, let's go down this way. Here we go, this is what we were looking for. What you found is more than just an artifact. It will help me follow the traces my people left on this planet. I'm glad it could help. I know you would still prefer me to have a corporeal form of my own. Well, yes. If you continue searching, I may regain some of my connection to the network, piece by piece. So, from what I'm gathering, these dudes basically had a hive mind. And he's disconnected from it. So if we can find more stuff like that, he can reconnect and we can eventually make him a body. How do your people communicate if you are not networked? What do you mean? We just talk to each other. Do you not find that primitive? We exist as data. We are all aware of each other's thoughts and needs. Scientific endeavors are accomplished much more smoothly this way. There's more to life than research, Alan. I can't lie. Work would go faster if I could read my colleagues' minds, but thoughts are private, and people have their own inner lives. What's this? People change and need space to think. Space helps you think. I find that being separated from my network is very quiet. What, what do you mean by quiet? Imagine a thousand strings each playing its own range of notes, none louder than the others. Each one builds harmony, a continuous thrum in the background of existence. I am now a lone string in search of familiar harmonies. I'll help you find them. Oh, he's all alone. Poor Alan. <laughs> Night Maeve, have fun. Just give us a shout when you're doing that uh <laughs> Give us a shout when you're doing that stream. I might not be able to join in, but I can at least make it fun for you. As you can see, I'm an expert at driving these things. <laughs> right, so we've got that alien artifact piece, so I can turn off the thingy for this now. I need to go and see Pilot Last Known Locker. Whoa! Oh, it's just a little angry fish. Pilot's last known location is all the way over here. Grab some meat and a drink and head in this direction. This is the bit where I get nervous because it's all big and open. So 
here we've got volcano. The fuck made that noise? Whoa! I will go this way. So we've got that alligator thing which chased me before. Oh, screw you guys. Little exploding bastards. And then... There was something much bigger. If I skirted round it. I might have, you know. Ooh, supplies. Get the scanner out. Got some lithium. Supply crate with food in. Ooh. Control room. More lithium. Oh, it's those things. Sea truck fabricator module. Yeah, so it's like a an underwater train. Then this thing you can make extra bits for it. Man chair. Aquarium fragile module fragment. Anything else around here? Fumaroles. Let's grab a bit more lithium while we're here, just in case. What was that sound? Oh. That little asshole. I hate those things so much. Right. Back in the sea truck. No, oh, that's where we put mods in apparently, and that's where we can change the power cell. Warning. 30 seconds of oxygen remaining. Right. Which direction was the pilot? That way. See, look, that fucker chased me before. But he's got a bigger friend I saw a few minutes ago that I really want to avoid. Right, we're almost at the limit of what this thing can go down, so... Here we've got floating islands. What are you? Are you nice or are you nasty? Whoop! You're nasty. Fuckers. <laughs> This is alien stuff. I recognise that kind of. Maximum depth reached. Yeah, I'm aware. Ah! I don't like you guys. Leave me alone. Park this here. Will you ignore it? It looks like you will. Uh, do 
Do I have a repair tool on me? I do. Needs a battery. No, no. Don't drop it. Uh, assign you there. Put a battery in you. Right, repairing takes way longer than it used to. No. 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 Oh, has it pushed it down? Might need to park this thing a bit further up. Yeah, it did. Right, park it a bit further up. What are you? Are you the friendly one, or are you going to go and eat my thing as well? You look like a ray. You better be a friendly one. You are a friendly one. Good. A glow whale. Right. So I need to head down. Rising lily pad. Top off on oxygen. Then we're going to swim down and see what the pilot was about. Because there's definitely some alien architecture down here. So he was around here somewhere. Sea monkeys. Sea monkeys. Sea monkeys. What's this? Exosuit thermal reactor module fragment. Not that I can build an exosuit yet. sea truck because there was a glowing bit over here somewhere that looked like the alien architecture there so we'll go down in that direction There is a large anomalous mass of rock that has broken away and risen above the surrounding terrain. What are they talking about this chunk of rock here? Leave me alone. Just go. I'm faster than you saw. I'm not that worried, but I don't want you to actually catch me. said there's a big chunk of rock that broke away which I'm um, assuming is this here Whee. just hitting all the fish at the moment Is 
So look at these lily pads on the surface, see what they're like. Can I climb on one? I can. It's a mature lily pad. Um Dangerous weather approaching. Seek shelter. Oop. Get in. Right, so which was the communication that told us about the pilot? Does it give us any other clues? Um Alien data, alien robots, containment cube, storage media, land cube, water analysis station. Operating manual, status report, Xenoworks, manual, Brad, La Chance, you don't like Cheese on a cracker. Saw me. Managed to eject the cargo modules and hide. Sitting here with the lights off, sweating through my shirt. I'm not gonna get pooped out of the back end of a sea monster to save Altera some money. Manuel, not going to be happy. Not one bit. Hi back. Right, so. There's a pirate. The damn a ugly pilot, thing followed me into say. the shallows. Didn't think something that big would follow me up here. Had a jettison the sea truck. Again. <sighs> I guess I could try to go back for the parts when it leaves. If it leaves. I really don't want to sit in another meeting with a manual. Manu, as he likes to be called. Ugh, <laughs> I just want to drive around and deliver cargo in peace. He likes to be called Manu. Yeah, he's called Emmanuel, and he likes to be called Manu. Warning, maximum depth reached, hull damage imminent. Need to go up. So down there somewhere is something to do with the pilot. I just need to find a way. Ultra capacity trank fragment. Good. Ruby. Copper, thank you. <laughs> you got stuck in your submarine hatch. Step Manu, I'm stuck. I need help. Gel sack. Right, so they dropped some lights around here. There is a trail to follow. Ooh, what are these? A hive mind. Lovely. Right, I am just gonna trust the light. Didn't I tell you to stay away? From what? I don't even know who you are. 
Marguerite Maida is the name. <gasps> You're on my It's turn. her from the first one, the Wait. badass. Can I come in and warm up? What part of go away do you not understand, Altera? I'm not with Altera. Marguerite is the badass from the first game. Like you hear about her in the logs, like she takes down a Leviathan with it and stuff. She was the one who was looking after Bart. So this is her base. And I'm gonna scan it. Moonpool. Bronze suits. Oh, she's got a badass looking bronze suit. It's got ribs and like customised weapons on it. Scanner stuff. So this is her base. Bitch, I'm coming in. I told you to stay off my land. Get off my Say land. Nothing. Next oh, time she's called I'll a Reaper. Carry it ribbons, Altera. I'm not with Altera. I'm Robin Ayu. I'm looking for information about my sister Sam. I think you might have crossed paths. Bull crap. I suggest you take the time you need to come to your senses and then get off my sea base. If you're not Altera, why don't you disable that damn tracking satellite tower instead of barging into my sea base? Maybe once Altera's off my back, I'll remember something about your sister. There's some junk on that table that might help. I couldn't get it to work. Mm. So. That far out to sea, swimming back for land wasn't an option. I'd die from exhaustion long before I made it to shore. All I could do was survive long enough to wash up somewhere. I felt a suction. And suddenly, there were vast jaws rising out of the water towards me. It had taken hours for the Reaper's corpse to float to the surface. Using the knife, I clambered up her flank and got a perch on top. I figured she'd float for a few days at least. Enough for me to catch my breath. But would she sink? Before or after I died of thirst. I had a knife, a repair tool, and three liters of water. At least I wasn't going to die of exhaustion. Now, those reapers, they're practically all muscle. But there's some fat in there. I was able to keep warm and drink the water. And I didn't have much. But I had that repair tool, so I had a spark. It took a week to light that first fire. And I know more about the burning properties of Reaper fat than I ever cared to. I had to ration fires, but as they burned, I could smoke meat when I carved out of the beast's ribcage. That was worth a try jumping over a pet. It literally doesn't give a shit. Oh well. So we got some new plans. What did we get? Hydrochloric acid. And from that we can make polyaniline. We got... Part 1 of 3 for the snow fox. Part 1 of 3 for... Fabricator and Aquarium modules. Part 1 or 2 for that. We can get a depth upgrade, perimeter defense. 1 of 3 for the high capacity tank. We can now make a moon pool, large glass dome, and a control room. 
and the vehicle upgrade console. So we've got more base bits to make now. Uh, did I have any water on me? Let's go a few first. Right. Um, we'll swap you out. There. Let's have a quick nausea around here first. See if there's anything useful. We've got underwater volcanoes, or thermal tubes. A few plants. Some lights. What's this? Thermal plant fragment. Useful. Uh, lithium. We've already picked up some lithium. I'll take the spare gold though. Oh. You're a knight. Or oh, you're an a knight. Take that. Right, I might have to spend a chunk of time just like upgrading my base, you know. So we've got all the bits for a thermal plant. We'll grab one of these. Your uh, New creature discovered. power transfer thingy. Right, before I drown, let's duck back into her base. Window. Warning. 30 seconds of oxygen remaining. I'm aware. Oxygen. Yeah, I know. But there's a moon pool right here, so I'm just going to use that. <laughs> All right, Dave. I'm good. So I'm just exploring. Right, I need to find my way back up towards my truck now. Whichever direction we were meant to go in. it this way and around yeah it was because I was following these lights wasn't I scannable. Scan. Hey buddy. Thank you for the copper. Grab some more rubies while I'm here. more rubies as well. Um, another 
one. Afterburner? <gasps> that sounds cool. Um, where is my truck? Truck. Which direction did I leave you in? There! So this is definitely an area to come back to at some point. But for now, let's head back to base. Yeah, try turning it off and on again, Dave. If you're relying on your phone for it, like, the phone app isn't that good anyway. So the phone app might just be shitting itself. Those two fighting. Detecting stern of an astronautical Soltrans go vessel nearby. Vessel name Mercury 2. Inoperative. Wait, if there's it's oops. <gasps> A broken ship. Throw away in. I want to have a look inside. There is maybe oh I need to cut through the door I've not got the laser cutter yet huh? so yeah that's a door that needs the laser cutter just see if there's anything I can grab metal salvage Some free copper wire sat there. So there's this little bit I can get into. Um, we're gonna eat you and you just because. Free titanium in got so you I can't get through because I've not got the laser cutter yet. You are a blocked door. Battery. Also, there is a chunk of this I can get into. Metal salvage, metal salvage. Laser caught a fragment. Yeah, yeah, I can actually make it soon. And uh, yeah, I can't get into any of these, so... More metal salvage. Another fragment. Massively Warning. useful. Thirty seconds of oxygen remaining. Back to the truck. So we will come back here later after we've made the cutter. And explore the crashed ship. Off. 
Oh, it's me, you guys. Oh, it's literally around the corner from this dock. Cool, I can find it easier now. Fuck off. Angry bastards. Yeah, creature design is amazing in this game. I love it. I even saw, like, big monster over that way, but I managed to dodge it. It looks like a giant one of those guys. So, back to base we go. But just the world design is amazing. But all these things look like tentacles, they're actually just coral. I thought there was going to be some sort of big... Like fossil or something. Because they mentioned in, the, mentioned in the first game detecting like... Gigantic organisms up north. But no, this stuff is just coral. It just grows like that. Right, so... I can hear you, where are you? Down there. Right, um... Welcome aboard, Captain. So... Batteries... You can go in the charger. have a battery. Put the rest in the locker. Put in there. Your crafted materials so you can go in there. And then we'll put this slot in. And now we need to make another locker, don't we? Chair. We can now make large rooms. We can make a thermal plant. Right, our moon pool is what we need to make next. Um, but first, storage. Two titanium, one quartz. I need to move my poster as well. Mm. Right, you can go here for now. Uh, so. Try and organise it a little bit. All the titanium in there, lithium, copper, more common stuff in there, quartz. Uh, so I have been able to sense the location of an important artifact. Good for you. I will share its coordinates so you can look into it. Got it. Right. Signal location uploaded to PDA. You can all go in there. Deal you. So we've got a flare. I've got a part for my sea truck as well. Um, and I've not put anything upstairs yet. So, sea truck. I have an upgrade for you. Perimeter defense system. So, next thing we need to build is a moon pool. What are we going to need for that? Fact. It is 10 o'clock and I am quite tired. So, I think we shall finish here for now. 
Um, no, I think the defense system, if, if it's like the first one, you can do drive-bys. So, let's equip it. And it's like a shock pulse in the near close area. <laughs> so that's the defense system. Oh, sorry, Bart. So, we went and found the badass woman's base from the first game. And she's killed, like you can see the Reaper Leviathan, she's killed there. He gave us some blueprints and stuff. So, next time we will be expanding the base mainly to make uh, the moon pool for recharging our stuff. And customizing our submarine so we can give it a name and everything we'll build the upgrade station so we can go further down oh no there's kyanite in this game again that's gonna be a bitch to find um so yeah uh, we'll be able to build depth upgrades and things like that um we found out that the sea truck is basically like a, a train so you get extra modules you can attach to the back and there's a hover bike we can make as well. We just need to find the parts for it. And I found a downed ship. So I also need to make myself a laser cutter at some point to get into it. So we've got plenty of upgrades and stuff to be getting on with. So next time I come back to this game, we will be expanding the base and getting upgrades, I think. But for now... We are done. So, um, next two days I am off work. So, I am planning on doing some daytime streams again. Tomorrow, Wednesday, uh, I am probably going to just dick around and do Mario Kart and song requests and stuff. Um, Thursday, yeah, finishing now, Manu. It's okay. So yeah, the plan is Wednesday during the day I am going to do Mario Kart and song requests and stuff. And then Thursday during the day I'm going to do Dark Souls. Because we're doing D&D again now. So you can blame Dave, you can blame Haggard for this. Saturday I will be doing D&D, so I won't be streaming on Saturdays. So I'm going to shift it around. I might end up doing Sundays and stuff. Um, but for now, Dark Souls won't be on Saturdays because I'll be doing D&D on Saturdays. So I will do D&D this Thursday and I'll do like an extended one seen as I've missed a couple. And we, we will bash our way through Dark Souls a ton. On Thursday and tomorrow we shall do song requests and stuff. But for now, we are done. I am going to crash for a bit and scoff some of these sweets you've sent me. So, see who's online, shall we? Is that Bollock Sherry still online? If it is, we'll all go and say hello to Sherry. Yeah, he is. So, I will see you all soon. But for now, go and harass Sherry some bit. Um, mainly you need to ask him why he's not streaming Dark Souls yet. Seeing as he's been practicing it forever and promising it forever. So just harass him about not playing Dark Souls. But until then, I'll see you next time. So, bye everybody.